Senator McCain. Rick Hirsch with the Miami Herald. Tomorrow, you're scheduled to visit the Everglades. Last year, you opposed a $2 billion Everglades restoration plan, despite support of it from Governor Chris, Senator Martinez, and the rest of Florida's congressional delegation. Why uh, do you think that, that were... That, uh, and that, that bill was... So you, was you're telling me what a, that bill was, was. Was it part of an omnibus appropriations bill? It was. It was. Uh, so, Seven you, years you, in you the just gave me the answer. You, get, you just answered your own question, sir. And that is that I will do everything. Uh, please, I'll let you finish. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to interrupt you. Please, I apologize. The bill was yeah. seven years in the making, considered critical legislation to address the Everglades, supported by all the Republicans in the Florida delegation. Well, let, let me just say again, if it's a standalone bill and it's authorized to, to fix the Everglades, I will be one of the first. I'd like to know how to pay for it. I am committed to the preservation of the Everglades. I will do that. I do not and will not and am proud not to have voted for omnibus spending bills for which in many cases there's no authorization nor is there hearings or scrutiny. I am committed to saving the Everglades. I will do whatever is necessary to do so and I've made that clear to the rest of the delegation. And yet, if we start piling on project after project, some of them, as I said, good, and some of them bad, as I was just mentioning about the earmark process, then spending gets completely out of control. But I can assure you, I am in favor in doing whatever is necessary to saving the Everglades, as it is a, not just a great Florida treasure, but a great national treasure. And I'll be, again, glad to look at that vote, but I, but I am not, uh, I'm, from the number, I don't memorize the numbers on, on votes. Maybe you could tell me the title of the bill that, that it was. But anyway, uh, you probably don't know it. But the point is, uh, I will do what I can to save the Everglades. I will not vote for bills that have projects and other things voted on them that have not gone through the proper scrutiny. But if the bill came to the, to the floor to save the Everglades, I know, I know very few members of Congress that would ever oppose it. But I do oppose out-of-control spending, which will then mortgage our ability to care for the Everglades, the Grand Canyon, and many other great national treasures.